Hi everyone, my name is Rashad Ahmed uh, and I'm the new assistant professor of TESOL and linguistics at the English department. Uh, this is my first semester and I'm coming from uh, Miami University of Ohio. Uh, I am so excited to be here and to join the amazing faculty of the English department. This semester I'm teaching five classes in, um, in composition, oral communication and history of English. A number of reasons made me decide to join JSU. Uh, besides the welcoming environment uh, and the great faculty and students, I have plenty of opportunities to grow as a writer, as a researcher, and as a teacher. And one of the best things uh, that I'm really excited about is to be able to uh, create offer classes in my area of expertise, TESOL and linguistics, and hopefully as a long term to establish a minor or even a major in uh, teaching English as a second language. My research largely examines the role of technology in language acquisition and development and autonomous learning. Uh, I have several publications and the most recent one is an edited volume uh, that was released at the beginning of this year. This book aims to bridge the gap between formal and informal language learning. And since also I'm teaching in composition and writing, uh, I recently published an, an article that examines the role of peer review in academic writing classes and how teachers and students perceive its usefulness and effectiveness in the classroom. Uh, currently, I'm working on uh, two projects. Uh, one is uh, on multimodal composition in ASL classes, and the second is related to teachers' practices, um, actually it's teachers' uh, translanguaging practices and uh, ideologies uh, in digital context. Uh, two proposals related to these topics uh, have been accepted at the TESOL Convention and the American Association of Applied Linguistics. Both conferences are uh, going to be held uh, next year, uh, 2021. In my free time, I like uh, playing soccer or hiking, uh, and I love traveling. Uh, one of my highlights is uh, driving 36 hours from Illinois all the way to California with some of my friends. So hopefully after this pandemic, I can get to travel again.